Hi. So today we're going to take a look at one feature of the 3 Series MDO which is called Fast Acquisition. Now this allows the oscilloscope to really boost its waveform capture rate to allow you to see those little transient type signals um, that may or may not be causing a problem in your circuit. So this is a particular uh, a data stream and it's not quite right. It's something wrong as you can see that the, there's a little bit of, um, of sort of a, an anomaly there that's happening. Uh, but we can't quite see it at the current um, uh, waveform update rate. So a simple tap of the fast act button will then boost the waveform capture rates. And you can see there that we now have what's similar to a temporal plot. So the, the hotter the, the trace, the more regular that's occurring. And likewise, the cooler the trace, which is the blue traces, the, the, the rarer of that particular signal. And you can see there's something there that's probably about 50% of the amplitude of, the, of the, uh, the main signal. And that's probably what's causing our problem uh, further down the line. And we can actually isolate that particular signal by utilizing one of the trigger modes in the 3 Series MDO. And we call this the Runt Trigger. So I'm going to switch Fast Acquisition off, go to my Trigger menu. I'm going to change the trigger type currently set to uh, positive edge. If I go and select Runt, now what this gives me now is it gives me two thresholds and I want to trigger on the waveform in between these thresholds and we can adjust these very simply by using multifunction A and multifunction B. And as we can see, I'll just do a single shot and close the trigger menu. There is our Runt signal. We have triggered between the two yellow arrows we only want to see something that occurs there and that is now showing us where our problem signal is